explore the outdoors today again. We're <laughs> yes. gonna have that opportunity. It was really nice yesterday. I know many spent a lot of time outside. We had record warmth yesterday. We hit 73. We're gonna be close to that again as we head into this afternoon. We are adding a lot more cloud cover to the forecast today compared to what we saw yesterday. That'll hinder the warm up a little bit, but we're already starting very mild. A little bit of a snapshot of what to expect. Very mild temperatures, near record warmth. Not quite so sure we get there today. A severe storm threat with all modes of severe weather are possible and we could see some storms even earlier in the day, but really the primary time is going to be late tonight, mainly after seven o'clock into the overnight hours and it's a very early Wednesday morning. At this time, things are pretty quiet. We have a few light showers out there right now and those are off in our southern county. So in Green County near Bloomfield, we have a little bit of rain into very southern Monroe County, northern Lawrence County, a few showers as well. And we'll continue to see that little wave push off to the east as we head through the morning. I'm not expecting a lot of rainfall activity today. Again, until we get into the overnight hours, that's when it's going to really ramp up. But really at any point throughout the day, we could have a couple of pop up showers, maybe a couple of thunderstorms. So go ahead and grab the umbrella as you're heading on out. 62 is where we are in Indy now. 60 five in Bloomington. These temperatures running 20 to 30 degrees warmer than this time yesterday. And as we head towards noon, we'll be back into those mid and upper 60s. I'm expecting high temperatures, upper 60s into those lower 70s this afternoon. Again, that chance for a couple of pop up showers or thunderstorms at any point during the morning or into the early afternoon. If we get any thunderstorm activity, we could see some of those become stronger to severe. But again, I emphasize that threat is greatest as we get late into the evening hours. The entire state of Indiana is highlighted under that risk for severe weather, and that timing comes primarily after 7 o'clock tonight, so we'll take you through it here on Future View. This is 10 o'clock and looking at some more potentially discrete cells developing. We could see some of these containing large hail, some damaging winds, wouldn't rule out some rotating storms within this as well. And then into the early morning hours as we get closer to 4 a.m., the cold front is starting to come on through, so right out ahead of that, We'll start to squeeze out that last little bit of moisture and that potential for some of those stronger storms. At this point, temperatures will start to plummet very, very quickly. Tomorrow, temperatures will fall rapidly into the 30s. And with any lingering moisture, we could see that bit of a changeover to a few snow showers as we head into Wednesday morning as well. I'm not expecting much as far as accumulation and not everybody will see it, but there is a chance that some could see some flurries and again, some light snow showers on Wednesday. High of 72 today. The record is 73. Be weather aware, especially tonight. Have ways to get alerts when you go to bed tonight. And then tomorrow, temperatures in the afternoon will only be in the mid 30s. We're up to 42 on Thursday. A new warm up gets in the works. We're into the 60s over the weekend, and we can see 70s return by early next week.